to the channel guys, Rukia here and today I'm going to be bringing you a video on Groudon and Primal Groudon. Now, Primal Groudon's pretty interesting because for some reason the Primal forms for Groudon Kyogre, they gain a huge boost to the stat that usually is not as important. So, obviously I'm going to try and utilize that one stat to the best it can. So, we're just going to hop into it and let's get started. So, for this set here, we're going to do max out our special attack and 172 on our attack with the quiet nature. I'm picking the quiet nature because with this investment, we're not going to be outspeeding much, so we want to be more bulky. And the rest of our hip um, stats, we want to try and patch up our special defense because that's where we're weakest. So the thing with the primal um, forms is that you need the red, the, um, the orbs to um, transform. So we kind of lose out on an item, so it's going to be the red orb. So our move set's going to be Precipice Blades, Flamethrower, Solar Beam, and Stone Edge. Flamethrower and um, Solar Beam, those are going to be what utilizes the sunlight that um, Groudon brings with Desolate Land. Lucky for you, since Desolate Land ruins water types, Solar Beam's going to kill them. This is always why, this is why Solar Beam is always a necessity on Groudon. Because you need that Solar Beam, because you can use it immediately. And so your only counter is going to be um, Kyogre. But the thing is, with this build, Kyogre is kind of your only counter, in a way. Because that, that Solar Beam, the one drawback is that for Kyogre is that this Solar Beam is now going to suck for it. Um... The Groudon that I have is, I've hit Kyogre's before with Solar Beam, and it does more than half, half health. And it's not even invested in Special Attack. So, maxing out our Special Attack might just KO um, Kyogre. Alright, moving on to the next set. This set might just be my favorite one that I've made. So for this one, we're going to be Quiet Nature. Max out our special defense and max out our HP so that we're equally as bulky as we can be. And here's why we're raising the special defense. Bulk up. We also have to, did I mention we have the careful nature? I think so. Yes, bulk up. That's going to be our bread and butter because we're going to um, get tankier. We're going to become a heavier hitter. And, oh shoot, wait. <laughs> yeah, we're going to be bulkier and we're going to hit, hit, hit harder. So, our moveset's going to be Precipice Blades, Fire Punch, and Stone Edge. Those are going to be our offensive moves. I wanted to put Dragon Claw in case Rayquaza um, shows up, so that's another option you can use. Let's see, what other options does um, Groudon have? Um, it has Brick Break, Body Slam. Um, you can use Dragon Tail for the utility. You get something out of here that's threatening you. Hammer Arm. You're going to be slow anyway, so Hammer Arm's a good option. Probably should use that instead. Forgot it gets Power Punch, so you can stack that, I guess. Shadow Claw. Um, Thunder Punch. That could be good, too. So you have a lot of op physical option with options with Groudon. You can use any one of them. I just think this is probably the best set. Right here. So, yeah. On to the next set. This set is going to be awesome as well. So yeah, for this one, we're going to be sword dancing. Now, here's the thing. The reason why I have, again, Groudon's a bulky Pokemon, we want to utilize that. So max out our attack, max out the special defense, because that's where we're weakest, so we want to balance that out. And the last four points, I guess, in the speed. The reason why I don't have the Jolly Nature for this set is because, look, we're losing 50 points in our attack. For not for like twenty points in our speed, not a really good um, investment. And besides, after one sword stance with the adamant nature, you go up to one thousand and eight um, physical attack. The problem with jolly nature is that when you use sword stance on a four hundred fifty nine, that's only going to be like around nine hundred. So you're pretty much losing a hundred points in attack power after one sword stance with the Jolly Nature. 
instead of with the adamant nature. So you want to use the adamant nature to get the, that huge, huge, big boost. Because it's going to be 100 points difference for like a 30 point difference in speed, which is not really that big of a deal. So just go bulky with um, Groudon. Because you need to use that adamant sword stance because it's going to push you to over 1,000 and not really a lot of things are going to survive it. For this set, I do have Dragon Claw in case Rayquaza shows up. is not going to one-shot you, but after one sword stance, you will be able to one-shot it. And our move set's also going to be Press Plates and Fire Punch. You need Fire Punch for all of these sets, all these physical sets, because you need to utilize that Sun Boost. And you get Stab on it. But again, I've already mentioned all the other um, physical options that Groudon has, so you can use those too. Alright, what's this next set? Okay. So for this set, is going to be a, a safer mixed attacker, because it's a lot bulkier. So, for this set, we're going to have 242 in our special attack, Sassy Nature, and max out our um, special defense. And the rest in our um, um, physical defense. I tried it HP, but the reason why you don't put these points in HP is because you don't want to have even hit points. Because if you have even hit points, certain moves like Seismic Toss and um, uh, Super Fang, they're going to cut you in half. You don't want to be a, a two-hit KO from... You don't want to be a two-hit KO from moves such as that. Now, I'm, I'm not saying Hyper Fang is a two-hit KO thing because it only um, cuts your um, health by the remaining health. I'm just saying that it drops you down to half health and you don't want that. You want to be over half all the time. So don't invest in your HP. So anyways, with this build, our attack and special attack are going to be exactly even at 396. This is going to be less damage, of course, than the other one, but it's a lot safer and bulkier. So the set here is going to be Press Piss Blades, Fire Blast, because, again, since our um, offensive stats are lower, we wanted to use a little more damaging moves to try and balance it out. So Fire Blast, Solar Beam, and Stone Edge. Um, let's see what other options um, Groudon has for special. Now, Solar Beam is obviously going to be, be your best one, because unlike most Pokemon, you can use it on the same turn you um, activate it because of the, um, the uh, Sun Boost. But let's see. It has Earth Power. It has Eruption. You can use Eruption. However, at the same time, for a move like Eruption, you want to be moving first, because you don't want to get hit hard. Um, and reduce your power from the eruption. So you have also have um, focus blast, you have flamethrower. Um, I guess you can go for some kind of hidden power. You have lava plume. Oh, he has iron head. That's another good physical um, uh, option. Um, I guess you can use rock polish to balance out your speed. But if we're gonna do that, I guess we need a different type of nature. Um, you can use ancient power. Try and fish for um, a chance to boost all your stats. Yeah, that could work too. And also, it also gets Dragon Pulse. So that you could use that on Rayquaza too. Alright, on to the slightly more fun sets for regular Groudon. Uh, so this set is going to, is one, probably going to be one of my favorites. Oh shoot, was my camera like this way this whole time? I'm sorry. Anyways, for this set... Assault Vest. Ah, <sighs> you guys should by now know how I feel about the Assault Vest. My favorite item. So anyway. So, Adam and Nature. Because we're not going to be investing in our um speed. Again, just be bulky with Groudon. It's the best way to use him. Max our HP. Max out our attack. Adam and Nature. And use the Assault Vest. It's going to patch up to our um special defense. It's going to go up by 100 points, so it's going to be equal to our uh, physical um, physical defense. So we're going to be equally bulky every single way. And our moveset's going to be press. Since you're using the Assault Vest, you pretty much have to run all attacking moves. So, Press Fist Blades, Fire Punch, Stone Edge, Thunder Punch. This is going to be your counter against water types and la la la. So, here's the thing. For this set... I also would highly recommend Power Up Punch because you want to progressively gain damage over time. 
and since you can't use sword stance for this set because you have the assault vest, it's another good option. But if you want to just go full aggro, get the damage done with the coverage, I think this is a good way to use it as well. And finally, we have this set for Groudon. Support, Disruption, ah. Oh. So here's how it goes. You set up Stealth Rocks, and, any thunder, and then Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave your opponents that show up. They make a switch, Thunder Wave them. Stealth, stealth Rock. Every time they send in a Pokemon, they're going to take residual damage. You can use Roar to face them out if they're threatening you, or if you want to utilize that damage that um, Stealth Rock's going to keep adding up. And at the same time, you can also use Dragon Tail for that. This is going to be your offensive um, chip damage. So pretty much this set right here is going to be Disruption, continuously facing out your opponent over and over and over and over and over and over and over, and they're not going to have a chance. Because you keep, you keep hit, throwing them out of the game, they keep th sending in Pokemon that are getting hit by the um, Stealth Rocks constantly, constantly, constantly. And if it's a Pokemon that you need to paralyze, you can do that too. Let's see, what other options does it have? No, no, hmm. Trying to see. Home Claws, no. Uh, I can't really see. This is probably the best set to use it. Um, you have Substitute. You can use that for subs. You can use Substitute instead of Thunder Wave, I guess. Um, yeah. That pretty much se seems about it. So yeah, this set right here. Major Troll. So... Max out our um, special defense, max out our HP, because this is where we're weakest, so we're balanced out, careful nature, and we become this thing that doesn't want to die, because we also have leftovers. Ugh! This thing is disruption to its finest. So, that's pretty much my set on Groudon, guys. I'll probably do Kyogre later, or tomorrow. And I'm sorry if I was all over the place with this video, I'm sorry if my... If I wasn't holding my phone correctly, I just woke up <laughs> at the time of this recording. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.